team that is super young and is still building for the future. Again, we didn't know they were going to be this good. So now the fact that they are in a competitive situation, he's like, man, we got to cut our losses. Just like your, your Eagles, when they weren't doing well, stopping hey, the run. It take it easy. Hold up. No, this, this, this is a good thing. This oh, okay. is a good thing. Okay, this is a good hold thing. Up. This is a good thing. Because on this show, any Listen, Eagles this is a good this, thing. Okay. Okay, go this ahead. Good thing. Just like the Eagles, when they were like, hey, we need to fix our run game, right. they made two drastic, huge, yep. drastic right. signings. Signings. Get that better. Right now, offensively, Zach's the issue. Now, and, and even that point, like, so in this situation, it, it's tough. As a, as a team, right, losing locker room, you can lose that locker room. As a team and then the coaches, when you watch that tape and you see the, his production, you're like, you're looking around like, what should we do? I'll give you an example. In Buffalo, right, we benched um, – um, Peterman? Um, no, 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 no. Before we benched Peterman. Tyron? We had Tyron Taylor. Yeah. He was solid, right? I thought I liked Tyron. Right. I think they could do better things with the offense, but they didn't do that. They benched Tyron, and it started Nate Peterman. Now, listen. He threw about five picks. Five but the five, five picks five he threw, though, he threw three of them in the first three drives. And I was hot because, first of all, they, I, I had at least 50 yards on the first two drives. I'm like, give me the ball. They didn't do that. He threw five picks, three in the first drive. So now, that next week, we all watching tape. Like, hey. Now, I, I'm, I'm very vocal. And our defense wasn't as good as these Jets defense. This is a Super Bowl defense. I'm sitting here like, all right, now, now, we go to the, the – so Monday, we got day off Tuesday, we came in like the walkthroughs. And the walkthroughs, he was starting still. Now, the whole locker room was like, McDermott, now what are we doing? Hold up. Because are we, are we taking or what are we doing? So he felt that. I'm, I'm joking, but I'm serious. He, he felt that vibe from the players. Right. Like, hey, man, this dude was through five picks. We can't win with him. Zach Wilson, we can't win with him. So we had to make moves in a bench state for the better man of the team. Same thing with Zach. But, for the better man of the team, right, we got to bench this guy. add to that, to, which makes this more complicated to me, who do they bench him for? Josh? Correct. Yeah. Yeah. They're not benching. That's, that's my issue. Yeah. Like, Zach Wilson well, 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 should be. Oh, anybody can do better than, than this guy. Than no, Zach. no, I agree. But I'm <laughs> saying as far as how, how permanent this feels. Oh, yeah, okay. You know, Nathan got benched for Josh Allen, who was the future of the organization. They were just trying to bring him along. So at least you're, you're, you're just bringing him in earlier than you wanted to. Mike White isn't the future of the organization. Zach Wilson's supposed to be the future of the organization. I just, I just got one more question. Shady, how bad was Zach Wilson? Bad, bad. Come on. <laughs> 